guys it's the real deal welcome back to the channel guys today we're gonna to be putting shards uh we've got 91 i'm gonna probably only pull about 60 um i have no interest in getting she math um i already have her she just sits in the vault i'll probably rank her as a b tier champion um great for arena can hit really hard but that's all she's bringing she doesn't really bring much else um and you know they're a dime a dozen nukas so yeah not really rated on her but there is a chance to get duchess i already have duchess and i can't complain you cannot you can never have too many duchesses um so yeah we will pick up a second copy of her maybe well we'll go for a second copy i don't know if we will get one saying that though i do have a strategy on how to get duchess i did make a video on this last year and basically when it gets to august you stop pulling shards do not pull shards and pretty much every sort of christmas um polarium will do a 25x with a two times chance and that is the best time to try and get your hands on duchess and i managed to do it it worked um obviously it's not a hundred percent guaranteed but it's probably the best way you know the best odds that you can put in your favor so we'll be putting shards in a sec but just before we do that i do want to talk about the fusion as well so we are pulling the shards for shyek and i feel like he's a little bit of a gap well no he's a big gamble it all comes down to if they polarium have hinted that they're going to drop another terror beast if that terror beast is legendary and they're awesome then he's going to be amazing Otherwise, I feel like he's going to be very mediocre and that's going to be a problem. Um, I think it's just going to be one of those things like in the past, content creators have overhyped some of these fusions like Pixinal and um, Pixinal. I remember everyone getting so pumped about her and then when she was actually released, she was pure garbage. Um, so I'm hoping he's not going to be too bad, but let's do some shard pulls. So 60 shards let's go boys wishing everyone out there the best of luck on their shard pools hopefully you all get some juicy juicy champions this guy is new ingrid twisted staff he does not look well at all he looks like he needs to go see the doctor um let's see let's have a quick look at his kit it's got a leech nice and uh decreased defense it's the weak version probably oh, okay no oh, okay he looks just pretty awful yeah hard skip don't invest i mean these days as well who even uses rares anymore literally like worth nothing gore grab actually i actually like him he's a pretty cool um champion great for faction wars um you know i might buff mine up a little bit I mean, he's pretty dead for Arena right now. Obsolete, but he's still good. You know, he will still help you early on in, in Raid. Come on. Wow. Nothing but trash. Apart from Nullhorn. Nullhorn, underrated. He's a boss. Um, he can be used for Phantom Shogun, um, Secret Rooms, and he actually does have a lot in his kit. Uh, there we go muslim mage um actually a really decent epic hero pairs up really nicely with seer seer and muslim mage go hand in hand until you get lydia but he brings in a lot of buffs and she can eat those and blow shizzle up uh Selborn boyer as well great rare um great for secret rooms there's a lot of secret rooms actually and actually she's like a decent hero especially for progression can be used in finite as well uh, with that turn meter back and i think actually she can even be used in old school uh spider as well legendary no way you are kidding me another armands do you know what i love and hate this champion he is so broken and uh, he's like one of the worst and best things happen in the game 
best if you're using him, worst if you're going up against him. Um, yeah, I th he is so broken though, unbelievably broken. But a second R man's, are you for real? That is amazing, and that's it. Bang on within the sixty, a deep R man's, and he's a barbarian. So barbarians, I'm actually maxed out for. Is he? He is barbarian, yeah. It has been so. I don't even look at factions anymore. Yeah, he's barbarian. Hmm. So I could build a second one out. I mean, amazing for arena defense. I mean, arena of defense, offense, whatever you put him, this guy's doing work. Captain Jack Sparrow. Um, yeah, that is amazing though. A second one. I mean, I'm definitely going to invest him. At, you know, I would love to have like four of him and just make the most annoying team ever. But yeah, he is an absolute beast. So yeah, that could be like a, Maybe maybe a slight upgrade to my tag arena team. This is my current defense for gold um, two. If I had more time on my hands, I could easily push up into gold three. Um, but I just don't have the time. I just don't have the time to get the matches in. But Armands, a second Armands. Nice. Well, that is pretty much the end of the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave me a cheeky thumbs up. And smash, smash, smash that subscribe and I'll see you all in a video soon. Peace.